Welcome to Spinelli Speaks. Welcome back to my channel, Danny here. I hope you are all doing well. Today I wanted to talk to you a little bit about my shelves. Now, from what you can see, I have done a little bit of reorganizing um, and I've showed you those videos here and there and slowly I've been putting more and more things on my shelves that aren't necessarily books. So. I've kind of added, you know, the little goofy things from the things I found up in my attic. But I've been kind of going through other things too, and I came across a collection of cards that I just have not been able to bring myself to use. And I've made the decision to use them on my shelves because they are such works of art that I really just think they deserve to be displayed rather than shared <laughs> because I'm greedy. Now, you may ask yourself, cards, Danny? What cards? Well, let me tell you, my cousin Ashley is a card guru. She makes the most awesome cards that I just, like I said, cannot bring myself to use them for anybody else because I'm greedy. Now, my cousin Ashley actually is on the design team for Trinity Stamps and Spectrum Noir. Now, these are stamp companies that make the stamps that make cards, and I'm gonna show you some of these cards in a few minutes, so stay tuned. And when you're done here, jump over to my cousin Ashley's YouTube channel where she actually shows you how to use these stamps and how to make your very own cards. And her channel is Ashley H. Scrap Stamp. Say that 10 times fast. I will put her channel in the description below, but check her out. She needs more subscribers, so make sure you subscribe. Now, these cards, like I said, are amazing. This first one here, this the wording here says, your brilliance is non-negotiable. Look how beautiful this card is. This is all embossed. You can feel it has texture and she has some little um, glimmery things here. I obviously don't know the verbiage because I don't make cards. Not giving it away. Then we have um, one that says brunch friends forever. And you can see it has a bunch of brunch like little stamps on there. These are all she's colored them in with some markers. Isn't that amazing? Beautiful cards. I don't know what I'd do without you. I donut. And these are little donuts. That's beautiful. We go together like bacon and eggs. Isn't that cool? It's like almost like a Polaroid. It looks like it's supposed to be like. And then these are all stickers here. But these are all, she's cut like used markers and colored these in. So they're stamps and then she colors them in. Then we have, sorry, I can't, I have plans with my dog. That one's pretty, it's got glitter, if you can see. Even these ones are embossed with some kind of shiny, I don't know if you can see shiny on there. This one says, based on the amount of laundry, I'm going to assume there are people living here that I have never seen. It's a little laundry. Very, very cool. Again, this is a stamp here that she has colored in with markers. So even like you can see her hair is a little bit different here. She's done all of that. Just beautiful cards. Then we have You're a Wiener. <laughs> You're a Wiener. So again, these are all stamps. All of this here, it's all a stamp that she has used ink. And then this is a stamp here, and then she's colored that in. Unbelievable what goes into some of these cards, and they're just amazing. And this, y'all, is my favorite card. It says Salty AF, and we all know what AF means. My favorite card. So on this card, this 
background here, you can see it kind of looks like um, ink splots, splotches, splots, splotches. What it is is she has inked up the card and then this is like water that she's created to make that that appear like underwater. And then these are little beads that she's um, glued on to appear like water droplets. And then we've got a little pearl in the mermaid's hand. And again, this is one stamp and she's colored it in. Very beautiful. I love this card. This is my favorite card. I can't wait to see this one on my shelf. But again, you guys, all of these cards she has made, handmade, and sent me, and I just haven't brought myself to use them because they're just so beautiful. I can't take it. So they're going to go up on my shelf, so you might start to see those on my shelves next to some books. Um, and I'm super excited to always be able to look at them and uh, appreciate their brilliance. So... Again, if you are interested in crafts and interested in how to make cards, check my cousin Ashley out. She is awesome. Very, very, very good. So I will link her YouTube channel below as well as her Instagram so that you can follow her and check out what she's up to and hopefully get some inspiration for your own crafts. Until next time, guys, I know this wasn't very bookish, but I hope you're reading something good. You know how it goes. Happy reading. Bye!